I love uh, telling stories myself, so I've, I've been writing for a good nine years now, so I'm very interested in the writing process and coming at it from a different angle, whereas which, you know, playing one of the characters uh, from the script was quite different. So, yeah, I was really interested in, in the script. It's been the first time I've actually read a proper film script and um, I've read plenty of books, so I was kind of comparing it to that and um, the screenwriter did a great job of it. I thought it was fantastic and... And people wonder why I don't go outside. It's reasons like this. It was a really good audition process. I had always sort of expressed my interest to one of my friends, Pete, uh, that I wanted to do some acting stuff. And then when um, he found out he needed someone for a, a video, a short film they were doing, he decided to come to me. So I was really happy about that because it, it was going to be my first chance to see how I went and said come in for the audition. So I went into uh, uh, the studios there in the city and, and did my parts. I only got the script that day, so it was a lot to kind of take in and try to get right. But apparently they thought that wasn't too bad. So, so I got the gig a couple of days later. The experience was really good on the film set. I mean, a lot of setting up and different lighting changes and things. And I found out a lot about acting at the time that a lot of the time you wait around while you know, they set up the scene and, and then when it's time to shoot, you can't really stuff it up because you you have to move on. So it's, uh, you sort of have to get it right in, in a few takes or, you know, you will be wasting people's time and things could, could go downhill from there. So the, the music video we did for Intrinsic was really good training for me for this film because it helped me get into character of somebody. Um, I had to play a pretty dark or hurt person on the part of me film clip, so that was yeah, a good kind of um, training for me. I thought we could have been something beautiful. We could have loved like there was nothing else. And pull the darkness from our heart. If I could hold you, then I would be alright. And, you know, the film clip was great fun as well because I was with the band and everything like that. But this was just something new for me, something really interesting something I haven't done before and it helped shape me into a different person because it was such a, a big leap for me so I definitely think the film was bloody cool to work on. Yeah, Julian as director was great. He had a really good vision for the film. He, uh, he wanted to see, see, it, see this film, see the script done by Declan brought out it to its uh, maximum potential and I, I think he did that. He really pushed it as far as it could go. Um, my friend Peter Zappia was director of photography and he did a fantastic job uh, setting up the shots and, and in, when the mood was right he gave it that super dark look that was, was much needed to create the feeling of fear. You're looking forward to seeing the final, final cut of this and uh, seeing how scary that scene turns out. Working with Matthew Grego, who plays Felix in the film, was uh, fantastic because he was a bit older than me. He had been doing acting a hell of a lot longer than myself. So in a way, for me, that I was learning a lot of different things off him. And, and being a new actor, I always will be learning off other people that, that I'm acting with. But him being the first kind of person I've acted against, uh, as in, you know, he's facing me and I'm talking to him and, and we're acting, it was a really interesting experience for me. And... Um, he was just, just great and he was always relaxed and I think what I liked about him most is when the shots kind of went on in it and it got really late, a lot of other people would, would have been saying, you know, when, when's this thing going to finish, when can we get home? But his patience was just unbelievable. He, he could have been there all day and all night and, and not said a word or complained and still had the same brilliant performance the next day. So I kind of have taken a lot from him in that regard 